ala rasulillah sayyidina muhammadin wa alihi wa man tabi'ahum bi ihsanin ila yawmil qiyamah respected brothers and sisters in islam may peace mercy and blessings of allah ta'ala be upon all of you i will uh, conclude on the topic i started that is christmas the islamic viewpoint i have proven to you from the quran and bible that jesus peace be upon him there was no such atonement he did not come to die for the sin of mankind every individual will be responsible for their actions the quran says wala tadhir waziratu bidra ukhra no bearer of a burden shall bear the burden of another and exactly this is what the book of ezekiel chapter 18 verse 20 had confirmed that yes the righteousness of the righteous shall be upon him and the wickedness of the sinner shall also be upon him so meaning the father shall not be the iniquity of the son neither shall the son be the iniquity of the father what lesson are muslims to learn from this that adam alayhi salatu wasalam when he ate the forbidden fruit he is responsible for that action and he repented to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the quran tells us in chapter 2 verse 35 to 37 fatalaka adamu min rabbihi kalimatin fataba alayhi innahu huwa tawwabu rahim allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has received conceived those words from adam and adam repented allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accepted the repentance because his promise is whoever sincerely repents allah ta'ala accepts their repentance what are the conditions to that you admit that yes you've committed a mistake you do not challenge god and say no i'm not wrong if you do that then um, uh, it, it means you fail to realize your mistake as iblis did and because of that he was caused and he perished he made a mistake he failed to admit he failed to admit to it when he failed to prostrate allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said to him why didn't you prostrate unto that which i created out of my own hands Iblis says, no, I'm better than him, you know, I can't prostrate. And because of that, he was cast out of the kingdom of God Almighty. And he's perished, he's, he's cast on all his followers until the day of Qiyamah. So, Iblis, he, he failed to repent, and, and because of that, he, he perished. But Adam repented, he accepted, he admitted the mistake, and said, Rabbana dalamna anfusana We wrong ourselves. My spouse and I, we've wronged ourselves. There are no much humble words you can find in dialects, in vocabulary, than to admit your mistake with these words. If you have not forgiven us, if you do not forgive us, and oversee over our mistakes, then we will uh, uh, surely, we surely be among those that are doomed, that are perished, will be among the losers. Then God Almighty said, of course, I am merciful. My mercy, in the, in the rahmati, but uh, gonna be my, my, my mercy overcomes my anger. So because of that, God Almighty had forgiven Adam. A Muslim needs to believe in this concept. A Muslim needs to develop interest in analyzing and studying the Quran and other scripts. In the hadith of Rasulullah, which is Sahih hadith in Bukhari, Rasulullah says, Talibul al mafarida ala kulli muslimin wa muslima. Seeking Islamic knowledge, that's what it means, not just any field of studies without having a clue about your religion, the reason why you exist as a human being. I love to express more to, uh, on, on a topic, but um, time doesn't permit it more. That's why I'm concluding on the decency and modesty aspect. Before conclusion, I will quote you evidence from the Bible that prophesizes the Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa of course. It is compulsory upon the non-Muslims to follow his message. He's the man prophesied in the New Testament, in the Old Testament, in the ancient scripts, even in the Hindu scripts. So a Muslim, the, the, the problem that lies in our country today is the problem of everybody thinking that they are on the right side. Everybody thinking, well, this is democracy, a liberation. They say I had already explained that part, but it's still the sickness of the people in this country. The young sisters and our sisters, the people, the, 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 the women that are revered, that are supposed to serve as mothers to our unborn generations, are walking naked all over the streets, all over the streets. It doesn't matter if you want, you put on a dark spectacle, you can cast your eyesight down as recommended in Noor, chapter 30, for the men to lower their gaze. No matter how you lower your gaze, you will see something haram, because the sisters are everywhere, in the vehicle, exposing themselves to tell the world, look at how, you know, um, devalued I am. My concept and my integrity and understanding is being eaten by the West. When they invaded our lands a few centuries back and implanted their systems of life and introduced their methods of life and said to us, you know what, um, your, this religion is it's brutal. You know, this religion kills people. What do they do? Do you know they have dead injection in their so-called democratic societies? Terminal dead injections. 
Do you know they also have life imprisonments? Do you know that they, they butchered people in, those, in, those, in that world? They do the worst of punishment to the people in that world. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he created mankind and knows what is best for man. Because mankind will never desist from always going into that wrong path. So God sent warners. The Ambiya are warners. And the method, the tool, the most possessive and powerful tool he gave them is the da'wah. To call people unto righteousness. As in um, Surah Nahl, chapter 16, verse 1, 2, 5. You call unto the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala with wisdom and beautiful preaching in a way that people will get to understand the message. But when people transgress, even God Almighty addresses them in you know, aggressive words, with, 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 with powerful words I should use, with words that, that signifies to you that the Lord is not happy with the circumstance that, that, is, that is happening. You know what annoys Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? One, one of the things that annoys him most is for people to falsify something against him. To accuse him of having a son. And this is another part of the Christian belief. That Jesus is the son of God. A begotten son of God. Giving God um, a low animal function. An animal instinct. We human beings, we have sexual desire. Because... We have the same principles to the rest of the nature, the rest of the creation. Everything is created in pairs. The Quran tells us that. So the animals, they have that um, sexual desires. But God doesn't do that. God doesn't possess such defective qualities. God is above that. In Quran, Surah Maryam, chapter 19, verse 88 to 95, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, wa qalu rahman walada. They say the most merciful, you know, takes a son. He has a son. Subhanahu. Glorify be Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah ta'ala says, Takadu samawatu yetafatanna wa tanshakul addu wa takhirul jibalu hadda. And thou li rahman walada. Wa ma yambagi li rahmani ayya takadami walad. In kullu man fi samawati wal ard illa ati rahman abda. What is it? Like a jiotum say an idda is last week. That's the verse that follows next actually. You brought such a terrible word. Such a harmful statement that comes. Kabirat kalimatan takhruju min afwahihim. In yakuluna illa kadiba. What a word that comes from their mouth, an accusation against God that he has a, a son. A son? Why would God need a son? When he's the most powerful of all. When he began the creation, he ends it and renew it. When he possesses everything, everything comes unto Allah as a servant. No other than a servant. So God Almighty says, even the heavens, the mountains, the earth, if not for the permission and mercy of Allah, they would have crossed and ruined you human beings into pieces, into dust. Simply because why? They are more powerful than you are. But yet, they do not dare accuse God with such statement. Now, what do Muslims do in our country here? The Christian comes and makes these words, and your Lord tells you, whenever this word is mentioned, my heavens want to crumble upon you. My mountains want to fly into, into air and then cross you into dust. My heart want to shake beneath your feet. But yet... When you hear this word, instead of running for your life, instead of crying for help and saying, hey, please, quit from that word. Quit from, from, from saying that word. You don't do that. What do you do? You come to them and say, you know, an open hand. You, 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 you scratch my back and I scratch your back. You scratch their back and they stab you in the back. That's what they do to you. They come to you and tell you, you know, uh, the blood of Jesus. What had blood to do with salvation? Salvation lies in your individual Concept about God subhanahu wa ta'ala, as Rasulullah says in, in, in Sahih Bukhari, hadith number uh, 52, in Sahih Muslim, hadith number 1599, he says there that, um, in the body there is a lump of a flesh. When it is corrupted, the entire body is corrupted. But when it is revered and when it is good, the entire body functions perfect. And that is your heart, your concept, your mind, your intellect, your conscience. What do you have about God? Do you believe that God Almighty truly exists as he described himself? Do you believe that he's watching over your, all, all your activities, your movements? You say, he, say, Omar, uh, he, he said that there is no uh, um, um, jama'ah. There is no jama'ah of two, three, four, no parties that are engaged in anything. Except he's with them. In Surah Mujahidah, God Almighty clarifies that to us that 
There is not a single gathering of two, three, four, five, or more, except here God is aware of them at all times. On conclusion of my speech, in just about five minutes, I'll conclude the speech so that um, I entertain a few questions. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he clarifies to us through the, the, the Christian uh, theologies themselves, the authors of the Bible, that this man, whatever falsification they allege and are tied to him, he's not qualified for it. He's neither a son of man, he's neither God incarnate. He was man, but a noble prophet and messenger of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He came to deliver warning, but they took heedless of that. They were heedless of his uh, statements, and they did the opposite of what he was preaching. Another evidence from uh, the book of Matthew, chapter 21, verse 18, to prove that this man was in God. You know, God Almighty has qualities. For someone to be qualified as God, or to even carry that title, they need to possess those qualities, then we will have no problem to call them God. If any human being can brought in, bring into his acknowledgement, into his knowledge and understanding, Everything that is existing and going on and had gone on in the heavens above, in the earth beneath, and in the depths of the oceans, and everywhere, then that person, we can say, you, you just get one quality. This one, this one, one quality. To be acquainted with everything that is going on. Jesus, the Bible says, I'm quoting, Gospel of Matthew, chapter 21, verse 18. On his way home, on his way back home in the morning, he was hungry. Imagine an hungry God. He was hungry. So by the side of the road, he saw a fig tree and thought that it had fruits so that he can, you know, quench his hunger. So he rushed to the fig tree just by the side of the road. In the Gambia here, if you ask any kid, um, I, I need a mango by now. In most communities, they tell you mangoes are out of season. But they are mocking against the, the messenger of God to say it. The man didn't even know that, that, that the, 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 fruit, the, the fig tree had no fruits. So when he gone into the fig tree, he found out to his surprise that it was not the season of the fix. It was out of season. Meaning, he doesn't even know about the nature of the trees in that, in that, in that area. God Almighty, you know what, 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 what quality he attached to himself in the Quran? In Surah Saba, chapter 34, verse 2, 3, 4. Allah Ta'ala says, They are liya azub anhu, miskalu darratin fi samawati wala fil adi, wala asgad min dalika, wala akbar, illa fi kitabim mubin. Nothing is hidden from him in the heavens above and in the earth beneath, not even the size of a weight of a mustard seed, no less than that, or even greater than that. The scientists previously thought that an atom was the smallest molecule, but they later discovered, of course, there can be quark existence. The Quran has described this. The scientific evidence alone in the Quran is a lecture on its own. But this quality, God Almighty says there, nothing is hidden from him. Jesus was just a tree by the side of the road. You couldn't tell whether it has fruits or not. You are not God. He never said he was God. So these people, they're making these great defects, allegements against God and his noble messenger. And you Muslims, what do we do? We join them. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. How offensive that, that, that statement is. It only came into even the Christian um, ex, uh, kingdom, the arena, 300 years after the man's time. He wasn't, he wasn't crucified. He was neither killed. The Quran clarifies that. I've quoted that verse in the first part of the talk. He's not God. The Quran has clarified that. The Bible has clarified that. He's not the son of God. It annoys Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to bring his level down to human level, to say that he has a son. How did he have the son? So he married Mary. He carried many and married him. Mariha, is that what you're insinuating? Subhanahu wa ta'ala, amma yusirikun. So, this is something that is so serious that is drowning our community, which needs to be addressed on the conclusion of my speech. It is everybody's responsibility here to contribute towards changing lives through Islamic propagation. That's our motto, the motto of our movement. Changing lives through dawah, Islamic propagation, Islamic teaching, knowledge sharing, Islamic conversations. You need to talk to friends about the teachings of the Quran. You need to save them. If a Christian invites you to celebrate, them, uh, celebrate Christmas with them, you have a chance to rescue him from drowning in the depths of the sea. You call him and clarify these things to him. If he listens, fine. If he fails to listen, at least don't join him in committing sin and transgression against Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Respected sisters and brothers in Islam, I like to emphasize this part in the conclusion of my speech. Let us not um, join any denomination, whether Christian or non-Christian, in annoying Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the creator of the creation. Would you please the creation over the creator? 
or would you want to gain the pleasure and honor of the Creator? He's the one in control. That's why when he kills anyone, when he takes the life of anyone, nobody does anything about it. Money doesn't stop you from that. Friends do not rescue you from that. So to him belong all power and sovereignty. We should all observe that in our hearts and, and maintain it and begin to remind ourselves the Quranic commandments like we remember our names. This way we will be able to dwell to our fellow brothers and sisters. Our sisters on the other occasion, I will encourage you. Those, Alhamdulillah, most of you or almost all of you are in hijab. Continue this practice and know that it's an obligation that you are in hijab. It's not an option. In Surah Nur, chapter 31, God Almighty enjoined his messenger to tell you to lower your gaze. It is not permissible for you to be hugging your brothers and be thinking it is civilization. It is doomness and blindness. A sister is not supposed to hug a brother. This is what is happening in our entities here. If you don't hug sisters, you know you are not part of life. If you don't shake hands with them and have conversations with them and walk with them, if you don't put on tight clothing, you're not part of life. They are sleeping. Don't join them. Wake them up and bring them back to the light. The brothers, it is no life, it is no civilization to pull down your trousers and be walking like a drunk cat. It is no civilization. It is doomness and backwardness in your concept, your mentality. God Almighty entrusts that, that, that power to you. He will soon snatch it. Before he takes it away and you are responsible in your graveyard, work on improving it. It's your responsibility to correct your behavior. Protect yourself and your people from the punishment of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Wallah, his punishment is severe. He makes you to sleep. He brings the night and the day. He has control over everything. Yet, you want to doubt that, oh, if you die, you're not going to be raised. Ayahasabul insan wa yutraka suda. Man thinks he will just be left neglected. Alam yakun nutu fata min mani yumna. Thumma kana ala katan fakhalaka fasawwa. Fajala minhu zawjaini dhakara wal unsa. Alayhis da dhalika bi qadir. Alam ayuhi al mawta. Of course, I didn't witness that, but the Quran explains that. Right? But you, you witness now with the use of scientific equipment how sperm develops into a clot of blood, how that transforms into a lump of flesh, and how the root God Almighty implants in the baby to develop it and nurture it in the, in the womb, conceal and bring it out. There is a baby crying. Give it some decade or two or three. There is a man. You need to reflect upon these things. You know, observation is enough. A lesson for man to reflect and observe and accept that yes, he is a servant, a weak being with no power at all. But with just an entrustment to live his or her life according to the divine commandments. That is what will gain you the place of Allah in dunya. That is what will gain you the place in the akhirah. We've got to be strong. We don't have to be weak and join the weak ones to be even more weak and make the society and doomed it. You are our, our future mothers, the, the, the unborn generation. They will be calling you mothers soon. Now, if you are walking naked all over the streets, what are you doing? You think they will be proud tomorrow to stand and say, that was my mom. You know, she put some short scars. You know, she had numerous boyfriends. You know, she, she, she always got to clubs. You know, those are videos on YouTube and Facebook. The, 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 you think they will be proud of that? They won't be proud of that. Every individual here has something to contribute. Those in government departments, civil associations, every individual has a role to play for Islam, for changing the community. We all got to participate. The scholars are doing their part, but everyone needs to participate. We all need to preach one another, talk to one another, save your brother, rescue them. This is just like, you know, someone heading into a pitch where there is fire. And when they get into this pitch, they get burnt and die. And you, there are gardens there. A beautiful dwelling, and you're heading there. So you're telling them, please, please, don't go that way. You're going to be perish. You're going to do, but they don't understand. And now, instead of doing that, you're telling them, you know, let's go. That's the, that's the, that's the way. So before you all realize, one day, one is gone. Oh, sorry, just yesterday I saw him. Oh, I had him just, just, just a month back. Everybody's time will come. The Quran says, when your time is up, there are no delays or any uh, adjustments. So walk on that life accordingly with the divine tenets and principles of the divine creator so that you do not be among those who regret.
May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us understanding. May Allah ta'ala accept the deed from all of us and choose us among the righteous. I hope that nobody here will join the Christmas celebrations in any way. Or nobody here will make those words, those two words, Merry Christmas. I hope that nobody does that here. And I hope that everybody will play a role in, 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 in transforming the message, in translating the message onto others in various languages, talking to them that Christmas celebration is not meant to be done, not even by the Christians, nor by the people that are most privileged on earth, but they are playing with their opportunities, the Muslims. May Allah Ta'ala accept the deed from all of us and grant us all Jannah. I thank you very much. Wassalamu um, alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Subhanakallah wa barakatuh. We move to phase two of the program. So if you have a question, please raise your hand up. The brother is going around with the mic. He'll pass it to you.
book is given to him, that is not learned. When he say unto him, read, his answer is, I am not learned. In the history of the prophets and the messenger, there was not a single one, neither in the Bible or the Quran, or even the Hindu scriptures, who among the messengers was given the book, and his first response was, Man I am not learned. This was prophesied by the Bible. Is it confirmed in the Quran? Yes. Surah chapter 7, verse 157 to 158. Well, ya Yohanna says unto mankind, Inni Rasulullah ilaykum jamia. I'm a messenger meant for all of you, different generations, tribes. It doesn't matter. He's meant to all and everybody. It is a compulsion to accept, recognize him, and follow his teaching. Because Rasulullah swore by Allah in a hadith that is uh, um, related by Bukhari Muslim that whoever hears among the people of the Buddhist message and reject it, in the year after they will be among the pillars of hellfire. So to save my brother from that, I will tell that brother, brother, you are supposed to accept this verse. In my view, the Quranic quotation, I am the messenger of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the Aladi, the Humulku Samawat wa Ard. You hear what you hear. Fa aminu billahi wa rasuli and Nabi al Umayy, Aladi, you aminu billahi wa kalimati wa tabiru, the Allah kum tahtadu. Follow him, the unlettered prophet. The Isaiah says what? That is not learned, and not unlettered, and Umayy. And even, of course, in chapter 63, Surah Juma, Allah Ta'ala says there again. It begins with purification and then teaching them the Quran and wisdom, clarifying things to them. Today, it was the West worst destination before his time. They were the worst of people, but he transformed them into the best of people. The country where today religious is widely practiced, tenets of religion and doctrines are um, strictly followed, is made. That was the worst destination before his time. So he succeeded in transforming them. So his prophecies are in, in the Song of Solomon also, chapter 5, verse 16. He was mentioned by a name, Muhammad, with the plural, plural of respect. In the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 18, verse 18 or so, I will raise them up a prophet from among their brethren, like unto thee. I will put my words into his mouth. He shall speak unto the people, all that I will command him. Who is that prophet? Muhammad. From the family of whom? Ismail. The brethren of the Jews, which are the children of whom? Ishaq. So it is compulsory upon every individual on earth until the end of time to follow Muhammad Thank you. Thank you. Our respected um, uh, scholars that have spared their time to give an hour course, we pray Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala peace with you all. You are very uh, important elements in our country. You are the key towards our success. Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam described people who are knowledge workers as the best of the people. He says, kept in fact in Hadith that is part of the Alim al Abi, a part of the Allah in Hakum. Why in the Laha, Malaika Tabu, for Ahlu Samawati, for Ahlu Adi, at the Lutu, what the Nana Pi Hujra, the Esaluna Allah will be in the same time. This Hadith alone is enough uh, to uh, approach the Quranic quotation which says, If I would have lived in Amun, who will live in Utu and Kataya, who did his mama Yasa, who will look at Hikam, and Utu Yakan and Kataya. As well as no doubt, I would say some of them. I've been into Dawa years when I was not even um, a dreamt of being a, a part of this world. Alhamdulillah, I'm just a student and they are present privilege to dwell on the topic. But voila, they uh, would have, you know, taught us a lot of uh, important issues if uh, time had permitted. But this is the movement which we hope um, to make um, an impact and continue to influence and efforts until the end of time, inshallah. We are looking forward to expanding it countrywide. We are looking forward to those, um, registering more students in January to promote Islamic propagation and education in all parts of the country. Uh, we are also um, appealing to people to support the movement because we are really uh, making efforts uh, daily uh, on, um, on promoting Islamic uh, religious tenets and promoting uh, morals in our, country, in our society, uh, which are the key to our success. Morality is the head of all devices for leading mankind to the north, says the place of us. So we have, of course, even Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he has prepared a reward for the right use towards us. What is this reward? To say thank you to them. To appreciate their patience and their hard work and their perseverance and their confrontations and for their heroism, their hard work, for not uh, letting themselves drown, for not uh, allowing themselves to be misled by the satanic, satanic influence. Alhamdulillah, our scholars, uh, we have uh, awards for them uh, in recognition of their service in religious propagation over the last 20 years or more. We thank them for changing lives. We thank them for making efforts daily, for taking their time to read through those lines in the Quran as well as in Ahadith and other various books. For using their time continuously to research and find out what is false and what is truthful and make it clear to the society. 
for making the lives of to service for the society, for educating and implanting morals in us, for raising good families and good students of knowledge. We thank our scholars, and it is my honor to call on the uh, dean of the School of uh, Business and Public Administration, Dr. Mamadou Mustafa Pane, to confer uh, the following hours on our video scholars. The first um, uh, scholar that will be awarded is Asif uh, Hamajete. The next award goes to Sheikh Umar Fawadite. The next award goes to Sheikh Ibrahim Gigo. This uh, representative of the religion of Israel, you won't be able to make it because of some circumstances. The next hour goes to Imam Isa Jawara. The next hour goes to The next hour goes to Imam Abdullah Fadi. We thank you uh, very much for your contributions towards the team and we pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala preserve you and continue to give you the strength to deliver the message. Amen. The next award goes to Madam uh, Fabi Kinejian. The next award goes to our uh, Senegalese scholar, uh, Asif uh, Omar Sal, who was in able to uh, make it in his day to arrive. Inshallah, the award will be The next award goes to Asif Mohammed Job, the Imam of MDI, um, who also said um, perhaps he may not be able to make it due to some circumstances. The next hour goes to Dr. Ali Jiba. We have Dr. Jiba from the University of Gambia. He's also been um, somewhat constant in giving our uh, on the campus. These are the hours of the Gambia's uh, prominent scholars. Of course, we must be honest that we are not able to capture everyone. That there are scholars countrywide of this country. There are Gambian scholars abroad doing well. There are Gambian scholars in the provinces doing very well. But due to the magnitude and to the power of our movement, we were not able to um, uh, include the scholars because we will uh, require a lot of funding and all that. But inshallah, in the next annual award, we hope to certify and recognize the efforts of most scholars, or, uh, if not all of them. We pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept the deeds from all of them and grant them all together the best in this dunya as well as Al-Firdaus al in Akhirah. We thank you, uh, video scholars. Um, you are indeed, of course, the key to the success of the society. Only those who have the religious understanding uh, know this. Alhamdulillah, we pray that Allah Ta'ala continue to preserve you. And we thank you very much for coming and for sparing your time. Inshallah, we give you um, a chance to uh, say a few words with the program. The next session of our hours, thank you very much, Dr. I allow you to have your seat. Thank you very much. The next hour goes to uh, various individuals, institutions, organizations that have also contributed to the success of Islam and to the success of the movement for Islamic research and dialogue through various means. We thank them all, and we also like to recognize uh, their efforts. I now call on Imam Abdullah Fadi to compare this hour. African Muslims Agency. Do we have a representative from African Muslims Agency? Munazamat al Dawa Islamiyah. Do we have a representative? Um, Mr. 
Cari jadu di pesan darah jauh mana yang dibalik di situ. Isu pesan dari kita di bawah sana. The next award goes to Haruna Mr. Haruna Sasayo, who is also bringing a great contribution to the success of my heart. We thank you very much for the program and your contribution. The next award goes to uh, Asen Taribosila, who is currently in here. The next award goes to our able dean uh, of the School of Business and Public Administration, a humble uh, man um, who has contributed to the success of um, the movement for Islamic research in Dawa. And constantly, he is always encouraging students uh, to keep up our commitment on academic areas and as well as in this program. Thank you very much. Dr. Omar Fan. The next award goes to Mr. Moropi, apparently also abroad. The next award goes to the Chancellor of the New the Vice Chancellor of the University of Zambia, Professor Muhammad Azu. Can we have his representative to correct on his behalf? Uh, Mr. Mohamed The next award goes on to another humble brother who is constantly been making efforts uh, in terms of uh, in, uh, Islamic propagation, is the record in videos audience and uh, be contributing by all possible means in terms of spreading the message worldwide. He is the one who has been making it possible for our videos to access thousands of brothers abroad who are benefiting from our studies. Uh, who is this is no other than Mr. Muhammad Ba, who is also uh, telling us our cameraman for today from the uh, Islam in the Gambia. We thank you very much for that. The next award goes to our Kari, who has made a marvelous recitation of the Quran son of our Rebiya Imam uh, Barham Job, Muhammad Job. The next award goes to uh, another member of our Kari committee, who is also being contributed uh, in Quranic uh, teachings uh, and, and religious propagation, Usman Jalo. Kari Usman Jalo, please. The next award goes to the man who has contributed massively um, towards my uh, educational uh, success. The man who had uh, helped um, in my early childhood to implant morals in me and to uh, teach me the religious knowledge. This goes to uh, Saint Muhammad Marena. I don't know if he's uh, present. If he's not, um, I will keep it uh, on his behalf. Do we have Saint Marena or any representative from Libya Islamic School that can uh, send out to him? The principal of Libya Islamic School, uh, Saint Muhammad Marena. Do we have a representative from Libya? Libya is like school. No. Okay. Okay, so please hand this to Shahmari. The next award goes to Okay, that's the end for the brotherhood. Uh, thank you very much, Imam. You can have a seat. I now call on to uh, Asim Hamajaji. Uh, okay, before that, there are sisters who are also supposed to be awarded as well. Uh, I call on Sister Arabi Busane to come for the following hour. We have Sister Arabi to uh, in the hall. The first hour goes to uh, Madame Faruti Nekjai, a psychology lecturer um, who has also contributed, of course, greatly to the social of Islam. Um, she has been uh, serving as a mother and a mentor to uh, the students from the University of the Gambia. Thanks, uh, that's uh, what we did for her. The next award goes to Sister Suwena Kulbukar. It's also been a great contributor to the Sultan of Islam uh, to the movement for Islamic research in town. We have Sister Suwena Kulbukar. The next one that follows it is Sister Anja Gay. We have Sister Anja Gay in the hall. The next one that follows that is uh, uh, our beloved mother who is the mother to uh, our, the chairperson of our sisterhood, uh, Madame Binta Jamin. Do we have uh, Madame Binta Jamin, the mother of the chairperson of the Movement for Islamic uh, Research in Dao Sisterhood? Can we have the chairperson of the Movement for Islamic Research in Dao Sisterhood to, to collect the certificate on her mom's behalf?
moving uh, onto the executive session of the moving project number Lisa Jendawa um, behind every uh, success life great efforts. Um, the people that have been behind uh, working uh, daily, constantly sacrificing their time uh, for Allah's sake, Alhamdulillah, and the executive of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa, contributing their funds, their efforts and ideas to see that this idea and this dream comes true, to ensure that, Alhamdulillah, we are able to stand here today to propagate the dream. This is the executive um, award. Uh, it goes to the executive members of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa. The first award goes to the chairperson of the sisterhood of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa, Mr. Mari Bijani. The next award goes to the deputy chairperson of the sisterhood of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa, Sister Aisha Duso. The next award goes to the secretary general of the sisterhood of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa, Sister Paduka. The next award goes to Sister Paduka. The next award goes to the Deputy Secretary General of the Sisterhood for Islam, uh, Islamic Research in Dawa, Sister Zainab Padera. The next award goes to the Program Manager of the Movement for Islamic Research in Dawa, Sister Vita Turi. Can you have a representative to the colleague if she wasn't able to make a decision in Dawa? The next award goes to Deputy Program Manager of the Sisterhood of the Movement for Islamic Research in Dawa, Sister Kasama Minturi. Sister Kasama Minturi. Do we have Kasama in Dawa? The next award goes to member of the Organizing Committee of the Movement for Islamic Research in Dawa, Sister Hawa Jami. The next award goes to Another member of the Organizing Committee of the Movement for Islamic Research in Dawa, Sister Fabi Jean. Sister Fabi Jean, is that The next award goes to Sister Jabu Sisi, another member of the member of the Organizing Committee of the Movement. Sister Jabu Sisi, next. The next award goes to Fatima Jaoni. The next award goes to Fatima Jaoni, Sister Fatima Jaoni, another member of the Organizing Committee. The next step forward that quickly, please, um, if you're an employee officer that receive time, Sister Maria Mapanati. The next award that follows that uh, goes to Sister Maria Mapanati. Sister Maria Mapanati. Thank you very much, Sister Maria. Let me have a seat now. I now call on Sister Maria Bu uh, Jani, the chairperson of the Sisterhood for Islamic Research in Dawa, to uh, present the report out quickly. Do we have Sister Maria Bu Jani? If she's not available, we can have Sister Adebi, please. Quickly. Sister Sadio Sanya, a member of the organizing committee, please come for your hour. Sister Sadio Sanya. The next hour goes to Sister Mariana M. Turi. The youngest sister of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa, but a teacher of professor. She's been um, working very hard on her studies, and she's been doing very well. Sister Maria Maturi. Sister Maria Maturi. The next award goes to Sister Jogo Kofana. These are all exhibit members. The next award goes to Sister Umi Jami. Sister Jogo Kofana, Sister Umi Jami, please. The next award goes to uh, Maria Ma M. Jalo, Sister Maria Ma M. Jalo, Sister Maria Ma M. Jalo, please. Quickly. Uh, As to me, Jamie, collect the award. The next award goes to Sister Fatima to Padma Dajai. Sister Padma Dajai. The next award goes to Sister Sarit Long. Quickly, please. The next award goes to Sister Jessie Ripsisi. Quickly, please, the sisters. Sister Jessie Ripsisi. Please. Uh, the, uh, the deputy treasurer of the movement for Islamic research in Dawa, who 
We also encourage all of you to continue um, spreading the news to the rest of the populace that inshallah in February there will be another uh, class of students and a school free of chat uh, entirely funded by the executives of the movement for Islamic Society now. It is free for all, it is free for all. Uh, there is a section for sisters and a section for brothers. These are the ones that have successfully finished the course. And today I'm not there, we are happy that they have understood something during these six months of service. Graduates, I was the first one goes to Broda Moodlam Sisi. The second hour goes to Broda Mood Sani. Quickly, if you hear your names, please quickly. The next hour goes to Broda Kausudabo. The next hour goes to uh, the next hour goes to Kiba S. Juan. The next award goes to Ibrahim Kamara. The next award goes to Kausu Sane. Dino, Kausu Sane. That's my name saying. Uh... The next award goes to Mamadi Sane. Congratulations, brothers. The next award goes to Musa Jara. The next one goes to Mohamed Haidara again. Um, can we have an executive member of the sisters uh, to present this to uh, Mohammed Sir President, please? An executive from the sister who to present this to Mohammed Sir President, who is a female. The next award goes to Brother Hussein Sao. Hydra is currently in Turkey. You can hand it to uh, his representative. The next award goes to Sister Binda Turi. Alright, uh, thank you very much, ma'am. Uh, thank you. 
Um, the rest of the postgraduates are the sisters now. Um, can I have uh, the Secretary General of the Sisterhood to present the rest of the hour, Sister Faruka? Sister Binda Turi. Yourself, Sister Faruka. Congratulations, graduates. Sister Maria Makonati. Sister Maria M. Turi. These are the sisters who have participated in the course, and alhamdulillah, they have keenly uh, participated, and you should have witnessed their presentation. Alhamdulillah, they've gone uh, again a good understanding of the course, and we hope that they will also continue to propagate and help in the teachings of Islam. The rest of the sisters who are present here from Pedro schools, we thank you and hope to recruit you in uh, 2018 by. Sister Zena Fadera, please. I'd like to give credit, of course, and recognize uh, our two best students uh, from the sisterhood, Sister Zena Fadera and Sister Maria Kuntui. They perform they score the highest marks uh, uh, in various areas that we are studying. The course consists of um, very, very important branches of Islam, as well as the local comparing religion. Time may not permit me to uh, explain all that. Sister Aisha Rousseau, Sister Hawa Jammeh, Sister Umi Jane. Sister Sanjo Sanjo, quickly please, sisters. Sister Sanjo Sanjo, Sister Fatima Jaume. Sister Fatima Ranjai. Sister Fatima Ranjai, Sister Maria Pujani. Sister Fatima Ranjai. Sister Maria Dujani. Sister Maria Dujani. Do we have a representative from the Islamic Online University to receive this award? I call on Seki Bujan to confirm the following awards. Thank you very much. That's all for the graduates. The Islamic Online University, of course it is an academic institution that has established um, a few years back and they are working very hard to, towards uh, decentralizing their branches all over the world and alhamdulillah they have contributed and are still contributing a lot to the success of the army. Do we have uh, a representative from Mobicel? Mobicel is a GS, uh, GSM network uh, provider. Um, that have been uh, part, uh, helping uh, the other GSM providers, but they have been participating in your support. They have donated uh, heavily to the movement and they have been supporting the movement. Do we have Mobisel uh, representative? There is not. Thank you very much, sir. That's all for Okay, um, I'm just reminded to make the uh, important announcement here before I call the video scholars so, to call the the, to the students from various high schools, Alhamdulillah, we recognize your presence, of course, I also have to recognize uh, the presence of my colleagues. Various presidents of the um, University of the Gambia Soft Associations, we thank you very much from the School of Medicine, the Gamma Arts and Sciences, and all the students, and we did the PPE itself. We thank the representative, of course, from uh, the UTGSU also. We have an award for the UTGSU, of course, um, I don't know if it is been captured here. <laughs>
minutes, uh, just a uh, few minutes. Can you pay off the email, please? A uh, few minutes, please, please, please. Well, let's be getting silence, those that are looking at all. We are almost going to the uh, end of the program. Can you pay off the email, please? I'm going to pay off the email. 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 Nampak mui pulau kono, nampak dia ni ada, boleh kau ikut nampak mui pulau kono. Waktu dia yang di kawasan terbaik, dia main dengan poling di sekarang nak berkelat. Wallahi semua wallahi, ni mutu mufonye makoran. Kawasan terbaik, kami dah lain kau faham dah nanti. Siap siap ni kau tu lagi nak kau tu mat bel, dia nak muni net, ala utara kau ni dah. خلقناكم من ذكر وأنثى وجعلناكم شعوبا وقبائل لتعرفوا إن أكرمكم من الله أكبر أهم شيء التقوى مو يسلا على نظرك إذا كان مو كان فوق يسلا على نظرك نعرف كم هو فوق كتم يمر من بلا نما يسلا على نظرك الدعوة عامة والفتوى خاصة Dawa mobile sakin, muso sakin, dindu mo sakin, English karana sakin, Arabu karana sakin. Dawa mankole, puru kamul kili kada Muslim ya dino ka, na na tadro. Ashabu Allah ilaha illallah, wa ashabu anna Muhammad Rasulullah, wa yikhami salati, wa yitai zakati, wa sawmi Ramadan, wa hajju al-baiti liman istata ilayhi sabila. Nino msimpu, mobile nino. Gana fudawa la limuondrone baake la hani, mkonde mta baake kabini na musuli jeni hidawo, paske nte IG inene shura na baake la tena was mkonde lenye hidawo na tiki Gambia, ni hidawo, because nte la karani moja baake hidawo la mkonde lenye hidawo na tiki Gambia, yeye samba police IG le nata noma, twelve hours imesoro, mkoni yendo kaso rebe demi sere sore kila kato moja mali. Wat aku nak yang mula? Afan ini dia ngah punya ribet dah ok. Ini dia malam dia long fam. Ini dia mutu rumah dia. Hanya fana, ha? Fana berada di sana. Ini dia. Ya dia ini tu rumah. Hanya belum dua dah fana. Sentris ini school ni mana opposite? Imam dah, imam fadil dah bersih. Di kau sungguh tu lebih kata selin dia lebih siru kono. Dia lebih hijab guna, dia lebih hijab buat tak ada mula. Orang presiden fom bersih. Mbanyi ndara ni ulunga ima kuibaka. Yukonde ni nga hida wona. Keba ato fongo ulita. Nde mo keba fongo lo. Akwa tela di muso ndi nga hida wona. Kakuru kara wondi doro. Bo ima mfati tata je. Akwe yoko. Nyindi nungo ni meonga ata sali misiru wako. Nika inkala ni mo mengi. Akwe nyingi magi hida wote. Ila, ila, ila masa bemune kwa ima mfati. Hansa keloba. Aku ada lebih keluar kela, purukan dia nak dino lebur kan? Dia lebur ambil keluar kela, purukan dia nak dino lebur. Taban ayah aku, minta dia dah nyuruh lagi, purukan aku yang pada dino malam. Ikan yang kala ni mungkin kau pun malah purukan asal lima siroko. Omang ke hidup boti, masa kau yoko, ada dia muka aku le, ada lima silmo. Ali be kelo kelo sudo ni tilo, purukan dia nak dino buru kan? Dia lebur ambil keluar kela, purukan Islam dino buru. Adun dulu kau gambar mana yang terfaham persen di Muslim. Ani jahat di sini dia mana pura pura musuh doji. Kau minyak Christmas sita. Ia ente ini kan jurnaliso. Aku ini mana fola Islam kau. Eh, mungkin dia mana fola Islam kau. Alai memang fola Islam kau. Nde kau motor mungkin Islam tu. Mula fola Islam kau. Alhamdulillah. Aku dah lepas mandi. Mama fajar seria. Kau Islam kau mahu fola kita moment. Aku ini Abdullah. Wahatani likita, wajala ni nabi ya. Isa mafu mumu ya kunte wala jumu. Allahu taala kwa wala loko, kulu Allahu ahad, Allahu samad, lami yalid wala lami yulad, wala mi yakun lahu kufuan ahad. Alama mwa wulu, mwa ala wulu, ala ni fima mulia, ala ya tuwa musamad, dafi umuli bela hadu tijara lako. Nga hina fo, eh, Dia tu si dua bilah ni matu, foto foto kat fikir nol lagi. Aku Allah ni muda yang kau mahu ikut dah, aku aku yang nak korang jadi. Dia terlalu mana ni, dia terlalu lembut aku. 
كاتي تندر دارو لكن كل كلا فيس ما له تلاه جمر والله بالله تلا من قبل نعم وين جاي كايس لا كموفو ميا لا باي بولت ما شاء الله نقول ده نون تندر بتوه تندر جام ولا يفوي توكل هارون يدا متجه فيه من نقول راجل كمون يا تندر كا فيس ما له تلاه جمر عجيب Nanti dah kata dalam amal ni tu cuma faham kata minta kan ulang kan enggak lagi ni kan? Mak aku lagi ada problem apa bila? Ia tak pun ada problem apa bila? Mak aku lagi buka semua yang aku isak malam dalam hari. Aduh, di dalam kamu itu logo no? Tapi ni nada Isa Isa Isa. Jika Isa lepas kamu dah faham, saya yang kau faham siapa? Aku dah terbaik. Nanti no kau mian aku lagi dia mau korang nyamin. Boleh asli soro soro suku mana? Alah utar lagi dengan ni lepas soro ini. Very important. Alu ninga ji de majority de fula de ke fula de mo fe bo. Alu tala ko wala sikin na yesta na la fi opos. Illa alladhina amanu fa mun min liman yata no da be perde. Salla mu minu shaytani wa amilu salihat. Ani e bara be to jama'a fa nan. Alhamdulillah. Mo jama'a e bara be de jama'a ke fa na. Me fa fula wa tawassa. Mo jama'a mo ke. Alu alu tala e man kutuna no bele fo. Nyan da ngay man kutuna no bele so. Ni mbaya mbaya kutuna na soto, ala kumperdita. Nde mbaya fali perdita ba, ala le kumperdita. Fali le mbaya. Wata wasa, bisabu. Wata wasa, bilhaku bisabu. Abani. Wole mbaya kato. E jagite mbaya mbaya ndia muta. E, ni mbaya mantegi mbaya 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 mbaya. Wallahi, ni mbaya kubi toke. Abu kasiya mbaya mbaya fola kasiya. Ni mbaya mbaya kabi nina misiru olo vyesfi. Sangi tansa wani sangi kilin komando. Ani njenga yeme dateli sisi ato bichi kiche mimi bano mkuu yeme nje mhamula mimi lumba. Ani ya. Ya ya dateli mimi misuro kuna jana. Haru. Haru. Mara faru sisi sisi ato yangu bichi kiche. Wallahi ani alkhadi bichi kiche ita tangu kwa msuo kuna. Kabini la ansaro ibe siri bende ishani mo batola. Fufu diro watu munda da yapo. Ena dambo kwa bichi kiche ena dambo na jana. Ako wallahi mkuunda ntele yimi misuro mimi. Ngo model be kelo kelo kavu misiri kote ngana lo itele mu imalu masjid itele na atenti ziara kote ngana misiro lo itele konda anta ola wala mbumbu ni afama ni kavu ni lanza ro ani adi mutata ji kasi inkambatu odu mutata ya kuto hat ni mustani tans tans sani tansa bangu kumole hansa mani na because inde ngaje inde la gani bisha inde la gani misiri doa mielo te kati pele le tata o misiro te. Iman saya kau mesti record dengan lola saat dia kono. Saya ini kau minggu hari rawat rosida. Eh, video pun ada studio ada. Nih cuma kau masuk dalam rumah ini, studio mandi info. Ya lola lalu mau dole biji. Aiyah din saya balas. Mau turun info lah mukis salat. Kilindo Muhammad. Ayo kalian ni muna Al Quran dan Syariah. Kilindo Otom Abu Bakar Sidir. Ayo kalian ni muna lah Julaya dan Syariah. Sepanjang Otom Sufyan. Ayo kara ni muna la politik. Abi bete la ngai, abi kara abi bete yata. Sila lundo la masake wa yala shule ta ayaka kwa ipa mama. Kato ati mukara mchule. Yalo follow de ika woke. Ika vuna shule felisa chube. Yalo mubunya bali tipuru ati. Te ati te shoko no. Muhammad Abu Bakar Sufiana Kalo. Ani kara ni muna. Sato. Mendori fulan. Aku yang kau say, alih insuol onde bah, aku ngal onde, aku cuma la suam bunyi tu, kau masak yo, ha, kau betul. Karena ni mula telefon ngamu ibah, aku ngamu, ni mula masak yo la suam onde. Say bermain for lagi, maaf mu ya fad, hai na fad, ni mu main ku fad, bivol. Oman jauh, eh, hai na fad, mu kena, aku hai na fad, mu kena ku fad. Suam pun. Kami nak koran dah dah mula. So far, aku Muhammad, aku saya ibu. Ah, aku mana? Dia kenal orang orang lekaran dulu hari syarikat anda di support. Tapi masa kita mula support. Hei, aku akan jadi support. Aku aku akan sedih. Ia boleh mula fokus soal aku. Hei, aku memang dia di support. Aku kata ni soal aku kalau ada guru bagi. Ia kan ni mahu mengapa fadil bapa ni mahu fadil entikai. Ah, anda nak melihat orang di sini semua musim lalu, dah tu di jumpa. Hei, Sufiana, ah, kalau mungkin ada dua orang. Aku Sufiana itu, 
Après, tu as dit que 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 tu Kami ni mana ni ngatu abel lagi, afun uta, ayah si muli ni tu, si muli tak guna ni mampu ni ke afun. Hei, aku apa ada? Aku pun ingin jemaah tu. Rasul, aku ni muli kau ingat ni ada aku ngatu abel lagi, afun uta. Si muli tak guna ni mampu ni ke afun. Aku sini ni mampu aku dengar aku di bawah aku ni muli muka afun tak jumpa lagi. Salam ala tani salam di dua rasul ala kalam wa bihamdika Na shabu ala 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 أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إن الحمد لله نحمده ونستغفره ونستغفر ونقبله ونستغفره ونعوذ بالله من شرور أنفسنا ونسيئات أعمالنا لا يهديه الله فلا مضل له ولا يضل فلا هادي له وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله. Honorable Dr. Fande Dean of School of Business and Public Administration, UTG. Honorable the President and Executive Members of the Movement of Islamic Research and Dawah, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. It is a great pleasure and honor for me to thank the Movement for Islamic Research and Da'wah on behalf of Gambian Islamic scholars and preachers who were conferred with awards for their dedication to Da'wah calling an enlightened people in their religion of Islam. As we know and believe that Da'wah is a duty of each and every Muslim in his capacity, Allah says in the Holy Quran, Call to the way of your Lord with wisdom and fair admonition, and argue with them in the best manner possible. Dawa is the means to success in this life and the hereafter. As the Quran stated, states, let there be a group of a group among you who call others to good and call and enjoy what is right and forbid what is wrong. Those who do this shall be successful. Engaging in Dawa work was the very task carried, by, carried out by all Allah's messengers without exception. Foremost of whom was Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, whom Allah sent to all mankind. The Quran says, Prophet, we have sent you as witness, as a bearer of good news, or glad tidings, and a warner, and a caller to Allah by his permission, and a life-giving love. Convey to believers the good news that they will receive immense favor from Allah. Commending those people who engage in our activities, the Quran says, who speaks better than one who calls to Allah those good works and says, I am solely one of the Muslims. Finally, once again, we thank the Movement for Islamic Research and Dawah, the University of the Gambia, for this precious award, which will always be a source of motivation for us to devote ourselves our properties and time to the cause of Almighty Allah. Wassalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.
Jazak Allah Khairan Alhamdulillah Ya Allah Sipa of the world thanks On behalf of all the scholars in the Gambia Those who have been able to uh, come here today And as well as those who are able to make it We thank you very much as said uh, Omar Kimata So for that powerful speech A word of thanks on behalf of all the scholars uh, On conclusion, I now call on uh, our respected Imam Abdullah Fadi to make dua Then we can go to the speech with that Our sisterhood, um, Valerie Victoria was supposed to make speech But uh, time will not permit them in Salah Nata We will conclude the speech with uh, dua from Imam Fadi If he's uh, uh, able, we will also uh, make it for three for us He said dua to Valerie, this is Uko Fadi Imam We have one of his poetry here actually, I want to have people to heart. That is what was in 2003. Uh, when there were conflicts uh, on hijab issue as highlighted by uh, uh, This was in um, a time, it wasn't an easy time. This was a time uh, when they were facing the biggest threat in life. When they were facing you know, imprisonment, when they were facing the consequences of torture, the consequences of death. But Alhamdulillah, they stood firm. 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 فمنهم من قال أنا قرأ منهم من ينتظر ما بدلوا تبديلا. أنا أقول بس إن الله يقول الذين يقاتلون في سبيل الصفا كأنهم بنيان مرصوص. like solid structures they never move. الحمد لله. this was not an easy day. 2003. I still have the record with me. Imam made a poetry. He made a powerful speech at the state house mosque on hijab issue to defend the integrity of Islam. He was ready to give his life for it. And as well as the other issue, it was not an easy time. We pray in hope that Alhamdulillah, since now we have our great scholars working in our government departments like our Gracia has given a powerful speech in English here, though they were not English specialists during their early times. But Alhamdulillah, he has uh, delivered a powerful speech. And we will be hoping that the day Allah Ta'ala will grant our leadership a scholar, the presidency of our country a scholar, that day the government sees the light. Inshallah, what will happen? And thank you very much, Imam. I will conclude with uh, Dua. This is from Allah Ta'ala. ปัจจุบันเราเรียนเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเรื่องเ
toto koroba jama fota yemi safi koro datela bu alakala purota kai toto musulike Kanapula <laughs> Fai taru wa koto, iko futu wa kanasia, musikile wa kanyanta, nilo kurota, musona nimbata, iko mulu wa kanasia, fulani sabomuta. Sufale, balu ya okuleata. Iko ya kamo adoti, mefa ukuyata. Iko dino manati, barile fanya fela horata. Kila le ya banke, adiso to besata. Oto ya kamo dino. Dina duke ulu samuta, misil mod be kumina, biril ala dunia da, sabiyo kilima bayi, kafiru lukaeta, musola lusila ala la, tu ba buya kana luta, nali ala dino. Dunia sudah beda. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah berikan rasa kepada waktu kau dan waktu kau ini. Allah will not have the Sabbath of Sibi, Allah will not have the Sabbath of Sibi, Allah will have the Billy for Iman, Zay of the Purubi, Okara Hilay for Kufra, Sibu Paulis, and the Alfred of Rashidi, Allah will not have the Wadi, 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 the Allah Rasul bina sahur aziz ladi rasul bihiya biya akum sunda zat kasaihi Allah Rafaalik abu abu rizkul ala tayyib rizkul hidayah kasbul rabbi 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 Al Hulayna kubuhi wa asyidal baihi wa tukrawiya rasul kaat wa tilmul kulliha Sallallahu wa sallam wa barik ala abdi wa rasul kaat wa barik wa alik wa sahib wa sallam Subhanallah wa barik 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 wa